All right, Christina and Alex, yeah, the 20 count indictment suggests that Mark Ridley Thomas and an ex dean at USC's School of Social Work. They work together in order to get LA County contracts to USC and for Mark Ridley Thomas's son to benefit with special treatment from USC and a professorship. Well, today, LA's mayor and his colleague, Paul Krikorian, spoke out about their extreme disappointment, but said right now they are reserving judgment to see whether or not he is indeed guilty. This is the public trust that we are given and in any way, to take that public trust and to misuse that for personal, family gain, whatever, uh, is something absolutely unacceptable. I don't see how it's possible to do the job as a city council member and defend oneself against a federal indictment at the same time. Uh, Mark Lee Thomas has been a passionate um, advocate to end homelessness. I've witnessed that firsthand. Um, you know, people, if the allegations are true, uh, people are complicated, right? They can do good things and bad things. Mark Ridley Thomas is a career politician. He served in the state senate, state assembly, on the city council, and as county supervisor. As the mayor said, he's responsible for a lot of good for his constituents, and it's appreciated here in Lamert Park, but... It's putting your own personal interests over those that you say you represent, and it comes back to bite you. That's just the reality of it. I don't care if you pink, white, blue, or green. Wrong, done in the dark, will come to light. You don't handle the job correctly, it's always a letdown. Right. Because then if you feel like that, especially if it's a position that we aren't always in, that you kind of maybe mess it up for the next person. So you hope that when somebody gets in, that they do a loyal and a, a hold the job with integrity. If you find black politicians, you're going to have a, a boatload of individuals sitting up in the wings waiting to accuse them of something. So uh, this is just par for the course. All right, well, you see there a billboard that overlooks Lamert Park, and Mark Ridley Thomas is right there next to Karen Bass. Now, we went to his home today and knocked on the door, knocked on a number of neighbors' doors as well, trying to get some kind of reaction. Uh, he was not home. No one answered the door. Also contacted his office again. No reaction. I also contacted someone who used to work with him years back when he was county supervisor, and that person told me that he's not 100% sure the feds got it right. So we shall see. Reporting live in Lamert Park, I'm Susan Harasuna, Fox 11 News.